The emotion expressed in exchanges between interactants is often unconsciously contagious. Laughter is particularly contagious. In the next technique, learners will be introduced to laughter therapy. <laughs> Begin with a lion pose. Ask learners on the count of three to demonstrate how they would roar if they were lions. The key is to encourage learners to relate what their bodies are doing with a visual, adding a funny twist to help them laugh. The Ha Ha Mountain pose has the purpose of encouraging learners to participate by breaking the silence in the room. Learners stand with their feet together, toes apart, shoulders up tall, with their hands on their bellies. And as they exhale, invite learners to force out a <laughs> Next, ask learners to incorporate stretch poses into their laughter. Ask for volunteers to demonstrate different laughs with different poses by asking learners to invent a laugh for each stretch. Deep slow laughter helps improve deep breathing. Quick light laughter helps improve the inhalation through their noses. It's important that learners know that while they may have felt a bit silly, the health benefits of laughter and the rapport building that it provides through emotional contagion are well worth it. Did you know that laughter's positive effects persist up to 45 minutes, promoting cardiovascular health and lowering blood pressure? It even speeds healing. Laughter eases anxiety and stress and fosters positive attitudes and happiness. It's aerobic, strengthening the heart and the diaphragm, the facial muscles. Endorphins are also released, instilling feelings of well-being. Laughter rejuvenates. Youngsters laugh up to 300 to 400 times a day, but this is reduced to a mere 10 to 15 times in adulthood. Finally, laughter increases attractiveness. It improves communication and builds relationships. <laughs>